okay so in the test configurations uh we are going to create a new configuration okay so this is the first we have to create the configuration so the configuration is like this one is for um web app uh testing okay and we can put the description here like this configuration will be used for the web app testing okay then we can put the active or inactive so let's say i want to put the active and then i uh, just after this after creating just simply uh save this okay so here i can see i have created the already the configuration okay then uh, let's create another one uh, and right mobile app testing what browser oh sorry mobile browser testing and but we did, and, uh, we did not say the chrome or the the firefox but yeah. so here yes if we want to specify like uh, this one uh, we are going to just create only the chrome okay so we can also give the name like this that uh, android uh, mobile chrome browser testing okay so let's do this chrome browser testing okay then save this oh, oh sorry i updated the previous one so let me create a new configuration and then uh, OAB. Pratik, create a user story in the clone configuration. Chrome browser. Okay. Testing. Okay. Then uh, this configuration will be used for the Chrome browser testing. Chrome browser, oh, yeah, Chrome browser testing. Okay, then save this. Okay, so I have two configuration. Uh, then I can create like this multiple configuration. One is for the Chrome, one is for the Firefox. Okay, so this then what we're going to do? We're going to create the variable here. Okay, so let me create the variable so go to the new variable and give the name of the variable so let's say um, the variable name is like um, um, windows platform or windows os and chrome browser and just you can give the variable name here i can or you can put uh, like um okay let's say just to keep with the configuration name uh, let's say web app chrome browser okay then add new and we can put description here also then click on the add new and give the variable here so the variable is uh, like um oh sorry this one is the variable so here we can put the variables like the browsers okay so web browsers let's give the name like this okay web browsers so in the web browsers what we're going to do let's say we have chrome these are the values okay then uh, firefox then safari uh, then uh, brave ads then opera so these are all the different different web browsers okay so we can just simply create all of this and can simply save this okay so here we created the web browsers then we can create on the click on the new variables and then we can create the mobile app browser Okay. We did it. What is the Android uh, browser testing? Oh no, no, this one is the variables we are creating. So uh, okay, so Android 
mobile app browsers no web app yeah. from browser testing okay so can we so okay click the web browser i want to just see a little bit quickly this one yes so this one we have like this okay good where where we are going to select the operating system yeah we are going to create another variable for the operating system we are going to create another variable for the uh, yeah. mobile browser oh, this is how we can do or the, or the configuration which one? these are the variables now we are creating okay thank you okay good. so let's create uh like operating system okay so in the operating system we can put like the windows 10 yeah. windows, windows 11 then ubuntu 20.06 or 08 something then um to desktop you cannot say this. Oh, yeah. As we are do, executing the desktop. But it so, is about the Mac. I think the. Yeah, Mac. Mac different okay. version. Okay. So you can put Mac here also and also with the, some different different operating systems here. And then we just simply save this. Okay. So we have the operating systems. We have the web browsers. Okay. So right now, if I go to the configuration now, like web app Chrome browser testing. Okay. And if I click on the add new, right now I'm going to assigning those variables with this configuration. Okay. So click on the add new. And here you can see the name. Name is the operating systems. And the value is Windows 11. Let's say. Then add another one. And name is like the web browsers and select the chrome okay oh, so the, why is to only less sorry what is going to happen then what will be other uh this one is only for this web app chrome browser testing configuration okay. then uh, we can also assign with the android mobile chrome browser testing uh okay. that this is how we can assign those with the configuration these are the variables we are okay. creating uh for different different platforms different different operating systems and also if we have uh, something else we can add multiple variables then we can just merge those with the configurations got it okay we, do, we need to create one configuration for the ios okay yeah so then we can do this let's create another configuration then and then ios mobile uh pro uh safari browser testing okay so let's save this okay and also oh, okay we can create another variable not the variable i think we can go to the operating system and then we can put here like uh, android then we can put here like ios okay so let's save this now go to the again the configuration then just merge with that like the operating system is uh, ios browser is like that uh, here we can uh, add like okay we can add another variable so that one is the mobile browser show here right yeah yeah mobile browsers okay and here also you can put like the chrome safari yep. then um firefox. opera firefox right so you can create like this multiple browsers save this and now go to the ios mobile safari browser testing configuration then add this like the mobile browsers is the chrome or this one is the safari right so safari and then operating system is like uh, ios okay then save this see and also go for the android mobile android mobile just uh click the mobile browsers is like uh this one is for chrome then the operating system is the android okay and save this see so this is how i have created the configurations and then created the variables then after that what we did we just merge the variables with the configurations so okay first we create the configuration then we have to create the variables and then yes. we have to 
merge variables in the configuration, correct? Yes. Got it. Okay, so this part is done, right? Yes.